you Sick of all the same dudes running up Follow you around, hope you fall in love But they don't see you like I do, yeah, yeah friends I see it too Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I have some serious deep cleaning with you. We're gonna be doing some organizing in my daughter's room. Lots of cleaning motivation, so I hope you are ready. Make sure you comment down below and say hi, and we're gonna go ahead and just jump on in. So today we're starting in the loft. This is an area that we have outside of our bedrooms. And Ava kind of used this dollhouse for a while, even though she has a new one in her room. So she hasn't been playing with it lately. So I decided to go ahead and donate it. So we're moving that out of here. We're gonna fold some laundry and just kind of get this space cleaned up. Whatever you need for me, I'll be Even when it's hard, just know I'll be Holding it together, girl, you know that's on me Yeah, I'm the one who looks you in the eyes Speaking like I mean it, what's inside, I don't want No these are just try and play the part But I'm the one who made it to your heart yeah, I show up on time, I know you need that. So we also had this old TV from our bedroom just sitting in the loft. I asked my husband recently what he wanted me to do with it. It does still work, but it has like a broken edge at the bottom of it. So my husband just told me to go ahead and put it in his office and he'll figure out what to do with it. So I put it in there. I went ahead and rolled up that blanket because I'm gonna take that to the dry cleaners that came out of Isaiah's room when I deep cleaned it. Now we're gonna go ahead and vacuum with my Dyson V8 and I'm just emptying it out. I try and empty it out after I use it, but I didn't this time, so we're emptying it out. I like to start with a empty container so I can see everything that I picked up. So I'm all done vacuuming the floor. As you can see, I got a lot of dog hair up. We do have our lab if you're new here and he shed. So I have to vacuum every couple of days. Now we're gonna go ahead and vacuum my loft couch here. But as you can see, I needed to clean underneath it, which it has been a very long time. So we're just picking up the trash. I'm gonna vacuum it, vacuum the top of it and finish getting this space cleaned. So in a couple of days, I'm gonna be going to Mexico City for the wedding. I will be sharing a lot on my Instagram story, so make sure you are following me over there. So this dog bed definitely needs a good wash, but for now I'm just going ahead and vacuuming all the dog hair up and the vacuum gets a lot of that up. This was empty and now you can see all of that dog hairs in there. Then I'm just taking some of these Clorox wipes and cleaning the baseboards there. And now that you're here, why don't you stay?
So now we're in Abba's room and we're going to get it cleaned up. She is helping me today. I like her to help me with cleaning up her room just so she can learn how to clean and make sure she has those skills. And she really appreciates her room being clean after she's cleaned it. She just knows that it's hard to have to clean up your room all the time. So then that makes her more motivated to keep it clean. So it wasn't too messy, but her closet, you guys, is really really bad i've been meaning to come and declutter and organize it for months now so we're gonna get that done today So I went ahead and gave Ava a bag to put all of the trash in and then also a bag that we are putting all of her toy donations in. Since she's older, I do make a point to declutter her toys with her so she can decide what she has been playing with, what she hasn't, what she wants to let go, and then things that she does want to keep. The nice thing too about including her is that she knows that these toys are gonna go to other kids that are maybe in a situation that they can't buy brand new toys. And she knows that her toys are gonna go to another home for another kid to enjoy. So while she finishes doing the toys, I'm going ahead and decluttering through her clothes here in the closet. There was quite a few things that were from when she was like four years old, five years old, six years old, stuff that is just too small and that she didn't wear this past year. So I didn't get before shots, which I am upset about. I wish I got those for you guys. I do get some, I do share some after shots with you guys, but you can see in the closet here, you can even really find anything in here. So we really make a lot of progress today. I always realize that I need you. Are you thinking about me too tonight? It's no secret. Like a drug, I am hooked on you Sweeter than summer wine Baby, just hold me tight Like a drug, I am hooked on you
So we're all done with her bedroom. Everything is clean. I just love a clean space, you guys. I know you guys do too. It always feels good cleaning up your messy space and just putting it back organized and neat. And I will go ahead and show you guys the inside of her closet, which I'm really happy about downsizing on her toys. There were just so many toys that she was not playing with all year. So now we have everything pretty much organized. This isn't your fancy, like perfect closet or anything that you typically see on YouTube or social media, but it is perfect for us and she's able to utilize her space better. Now we're gonna go ahead and put in some new light bulbs in this bathroom. This was Isaiah's bathroom before he moved out. So we're gonna go ahead and deep clean it. We're gonna put these brighter lights in here and then eventually I am going to buy like new bathroom decor and like a new shower curtain and all the new things to add in here and just kind of give it a little bit of a refresh. I've been hanging on counting days thinking it was me all along. Had a million conversations in my head about where it went wrong And I've got no idea where you've been, who you are, not anymore All I got is this Polaroid picture of us from June 24th It's where I kissed you for the first time, laid on your sheet Gave me your heart and said you trusted with me But all I did was let you down time and time again It wasn't my intention Maybe we should have been friends So You're someone I used to know But nobody said it'd be easy But maybe I should have known so instead of using three separate sprays and spraying the sink and then spraying the bathtub with bathtub cleaner and the toilet and so on, I just went ahead and filled up a big bucket of pine salt and I'm just going to use it in each area. I do end up like dumping it out in between and then refilling it up and just kind of cleaning like that. I really like doing that today. It made things a lot faster and I felt like I got, got a better clean. Do you remember how we pulled the drapes in the basement to get away from the world that we couldn't fit in? And how we used to walk those empty streets at night in the city lights is where I saw you for the last time, said our goodbyes, sat in the car, you saw the pain in my eyes, but I just couldn't let you down time and time again. It wasn't my intention, maybe we should have been friends. So, you're someone I used to know But nobody said it'd be easy But maybe I should have known One more drink to swallow it down I gotta get you out of my mind But nobody said it was easy But maybe I should have known Guitar So doing it this way also allowed me to just squeeze water all in that back of the toilet there of the toilet seat and it would just fall down the back of the toilet and then you can kind of see like the urine going down to the base of the toilet and it's from those little knobs that connect that toilet cover onto the toilet and so I just felt like I got such a good clean doing it this way and then right now I'm just using my Clorox wand to really scrub in the toilet bowl and clean that up as well. So right here I did go ahead and refill up a new uh, bucket of the pine salt water and I dumped the old water down in the toilet and then I'm going ahead and using a different cloth to wipe down the walls.
so now we're gonna go ahead and steam clean the floor I wanted you guys I wanted you guys to see that I did put a new uh, mop head on it just so you can see how clean it is and then I'll show you how much dirt and everything we pick up at the end I already put new water in here so we're just gonna plug it in and start steam cleaning the floors So that is all I have for you today. I hope you got some deep cleaning motivation from today's video. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed it. Also comment down below, let me know how you're doing. Give me a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and I will see all of you guys in the next video. Bye you guys.